Yeah, I'll react to that, sure. Can you be more uh, the It Crowd. Let's do it. Original link to the video, top of the description, below that, link to the Discord, click on it, send you right over there, preemptive like. Let's go. Uh, I have not seen this. Means which or the, the, obviously, I haven't seen this video. I haven't seen it crowd yet. My name's Connor. I, did I, I? I said it probably. Hi. Means a means which means a profit so far this year of eighteen hundred billion billion. <laughs> Splendid. And this doesn't even include the added revenue arising from your takeover of ITV. ITV. I'd forgotten about ITV. Brilliant! <laughs> Gentlemen, when I first started Wenham Industries, I had just two things in my possession. A dream and six million pounds. <laughs> Today, I have a business empire the like of which the world has never seen the like of which. I hope it doesn't sound arrogant when I say that I am the greatest man in the world. <laughs> Here. Gentlemen, to the future. Oh, you don't have any glasses. Just pretend. I have lemonade. The future. The future. The future. Um, sorry to interrupt, but there are some policemen here. They say they need to speak to you about irregularities in the pension fund. I see. Could you make me a cup of tea, please, Stephanie? Could you make me a cup of tea, please, Stephanie? That's one of my favorite gifts. I'm gift. I'm gift master on Discord. <laughs> I knew what was gonna happen. God, man, that probably wasn't the greatest point. To it's comedy. All right, next one. The It Crowd, Douglas talks about Winston. Primitive like. Specific. It's just I'm Can you be more specific? It's just I'm trying to build a more picture of your role in Renham Industries. Atlanta. Well, I'm the boss. Head honcho. El numero uno. Mr. Big. The Godfather. Lord of the Rings. The Born Identity. Uh, the taxi driver. Really? Jaws. <laughs> Awesome. I forgot the question quite a while back. Who are you again? I'm April Shepard. You're being made Richest Magazine's Man of the Year. I'm doing the profile. Oh, yes, that's right. I mean, I know you're the boss, but what does that entail? Oh, many things. Like this morning, for instance. I had to choose the employee of the month from the box. <laughs> May I ask, what are you doing on that pad? One of my little hobbies is caricature. <laughs> Sometimes I like to sketch someone as I'm talking to them. <laughs> May I? Well, I'm not very good. I'm no Truman Capote. <laughs> Who's he again? <laughs> Great, okay. Um, I'll tell you what, let's just do some quickfire questions. Okay. Maybe they'll give me an insight into the real you. Okay. Right, tell me, who is your favorite person from history? Sherlock Holmes. Napoleon. <laughs> well, he's fictional. Whoa. <laughs> Think you better check your facts there. Fictional. Who took care of the business with the giant dog that was eating everybody? <laughs> well, it wasn't Watson. Don't tell me. I suppose he was fictional too. Maybe there was no giant dog. <laughs> no, no. I think you're playing games with me, young lady. Okay, then, favorite fictional character? Oh, <laughs> the elephant man. <laughs> Tell you what, let me widen the question out. John Favorite Merrick? popular figure? John Merrick? Churchill. Wow, what is it you like about him? I love the way he says, oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. I think perhaps it's you who's playing games with me. You're a very surprising man, Mr. Renham. Yes. <laughs> I am a surprising man. <laughs> April, may I take you to dinner? Oh, I, I don't think I could... In listen. Paris? <laughs> Paris? Paris, yes. It's the name of a new restaurant in Hull. That's right. We're going to Hull. 
it what it would have been cool if she said may i take you to dinner surprising man <laughs> april may i take you to dinner you may because it's it's also a month april her name's april may you may <clears throat> Sign here, here, here. Yeah, and I reckon I know where to sign on a sexual harassment settlement. Thank you. <laughs> I've got to thank you, Jeb, for not taking this matter any further. Not only does that show great maturity, but also, uh, is she asleep? I'm not asleep. I thought so. All right, all right. It's not just the money, you know. I know. There's a principle involved. Parting with the money was painful enough. But the electric pants I have to wear at work so I don't become aroused. Well, they're also great. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm just charging them. Wouldn't that do the opposite? Don't say anything that'll get me going, either of you. Does it hurt, you know, when you... It's like being tased in the balls. <laughs> Tea? No, thank you. Like being tased in the balls. Except painful. <laughs> Deep. But I'm not aroused, it's only cars. God damn these electric sex bands. <laughs> He's got some weird kinks. Coffee and cars. Good God! Get me IT! <laughs> I mean, it's gonna be like a beautiful woman. Oh, never mind. You there, computer man. Fix my pants. Take your pardon? Pull down my trousers and do your job. Pull down my pants and fix my pants. Pull down my trousers and do your job. And welcome doing a job. to this, our first interfaith tour of Renham oh, Industries. Uh, I thought we'd start with the IT department because, well, to be honest, we do tend to forget about them a bit, buried down here in the basement, and they really are lovely guys. <laughs> Let's go in and say hello. But I don't know what it is. Just pull that thing there. I don't know. Fiddle about with it. <laughs> <laughs> to try that wire. Who are you? So you don't. I could get to like it. Just the job. Good work. Mmm. Nice and loose. I'm in my happy place. I'm in my happy place. I'm in my happy place. I'm not doing another one. I did three there. Did Middle Ages happen? Conspiracy? Um. Yo. All right, guys. Love y'all. Hope you're doing well. Hope you enjoyed that. Love to see your comments. Chin up if you're not doing well, by the way. Emotions are fickle, my friend. You'll be fine. Bye, guys.